Today we will be demonstrating one of our tests that we perform on logic ICs, specifically EEPROMs and processors that we see on logic circuit boards, such as the one we have in front of us here today. So right now we have the correct power going into the board and currently at 5 volts it's drawing about 3 quarters of an amp, which is higher for a circuit board but with these kinds of processors on it, it is not bad. That's actually expected. So we will be going ahead and first testing on our 5 volt line whether or not we have good power going to 5 volts. And as you can see, we have 5 volts. Our oscilloscope is set up for 5 volts or 1 volt per division. So here we have a good clean 5 volts running on the 5 volt line of this logic board. The 5 volt line of the logic board is all tied together in the same place. So, as you can see, 5 volts there. We have 5 volts again there. And so forth. So, now we are going to be looking at the processors and EEPROMs on the board to see if there is data flow occurring. So, here we have our 5 volt line and now we will put our probe on one of the data channels. And you can see that we have data transmission flowing. We will check another channel. And that is what we like to see coming off these chips when they are powered. Now depending on the design of the board, this may or may not occur as some boards need to have a certain trigger in order for the data to flow. But on this board, the data is flowing just on power up. Thank you for watching. For more videos, subscribe to our channel.